I'd just like to say hello from the, um, from the past to the people in the future. Um, I hope you still have birds and uh, trees, because <laughs> at this rate, there won't be fucking in many left. <laughs> Drinking muddy water And it tastes like turpentine I've been leaving muddy footprints Up and down the Morgan Mile Crows are crying Taking scraps from back doors It's the name of a, of a Tom Waits song uh, that I, uh, I used to play and uh, it probably would have, been, would have been one of my favourite songs. It's take an eye for an eye and a tooth for a tooth, just like it says in the Bible. That's, uh, that's where that one starts. And, uh, and yeah, just a, I guess about a, um, a shadowy figure uh, and uh, I presume that character is uh, they say that that uh, beneath his coat, they say that he has wings. This character, uh, black wings, I guess. So uh, that appealed to me in the whole gothic, um, the gothic sort of implication from that as well. You know, I did a couple of gigs in Dublin with some friends over there, uh, and uh, that was quite disastrous in a small pub in Dunleary. Uh, and then when I came back to New Zealand, uh, my brother JC Burns, who is the, the bass player, uh, him and I started working on a few tracks and we called that Black Wings and that's how it, that's how it started like that. Well, it all started off with the um, duelling, you've heard of the duelling banjos. We, uh, we don't have banjos, so we, we have dueling button accordions. It's, it's a pretty wild thing to see. Uh, because it's a three-piece, you've got a lot of room to move. You're not getting in people's way, so you can afford to be a bit flamboyant. I guess if you like with what you're playing, um, there's a lot of room for uh, a bit of experimentation and uh, I think we all like that approach that when you're up on stage if something occurs to you just go for it and hopefully the other two will be able to follow. But country influenced, blues influenced, uh, there's, in, there's, uh, yeah, there's a lot of influences on it. 
but I'd say the fact that it's a three piece is maybe the strongest uh, influence on our music as it makes you think outside the box and instead of the you know two electric guitar sound which is you know sort of the standard in New Zealand uh, pop slash rock bands you know we were learning songs by um, the Gordons and, and Wire and um, Killing Joke and that sort of thing as opposed to you know the mainstream that's how we, we learned, I guess, was playing songs that we were interested in, in ourselves. Uh, I heard someone say something about listening one time. And I, I, I guess I, I, mean, I, I listened a bit more and I think you know, I, I realised that I don't have to go through horrendous disasters myself to, um, to be able to write material. Um, and uh, you know you can, you can see what's going on around and that. There's you know there's hardly there's hardly any good news that I see. So I I, I guess I'm still be writing a little bit about that. But someone said to me one time, you should open your eyes when you sing because you, people can see into your soul then when you're singing. And I said, well that's why I close my eyes. <laughs> spend as long as we want. Often years working on a song. How does, uh, how does Black Wings fit into the Palmerston North music scene? Um, I think the word is, is uncomfortably. Um, and uh, yeah, it's a word I've probably heard, heard used before um, with, with regard to what we do anyway. Uh, is it's, it is you know maybe it's um, we're not we're not quite you know we don't we, we don't fit in we wouldn't fit into a folk club or you know we're not punk or we're not heavy metal and we're not um, you know straight gothic or we're sort of a, a bit of a mixture of them but which verge a little bit more towards um, sort of uh, country mixed in there as well so when there's you know when there's a metal night or a punk night or a, it's it's quite hard to get a, a, a night where we where we fit yeah well, if the venue is really small it's fucking packed it's awesome you know i'm 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 probably uh you could probably say um, certainly amongst the oldest uh, of the Palmerston North, you know, rock music scene. But, um, you know, we've, we started this out for six years ago, so, you know, we've been going for six years, so, you know, that's the same as we're, we're, we're really having to fight it out with all the, uh, the youngsters. And, um, uh, yeah, this is the thing, I think we, I think we hold our own, but we, we, we we can't really rely on you know trying to get everyone jumping around and heaps of energy and pumping fists and you know all that kind of raging stuff you know we're more um, I guess you know this is hopefully a band that will carry on a, a long time into the future um, uh, that's you know that's the plan 